Hello, I'm Keetron Evans, and I want to talk to you about our new cyber range and our newly adapted skills environment and explain to you why it's the most comprehensive and deepest library of cybersecurity training on the market. I'm going to click Start Lab. And right away, you got two fully loaded, fully functioning virtual machines that are already up and running. But I really want you to take a look at this lab so that I can highlight really quickly some things that make it useful. So I want to show you how easily this can be done. So what it says is it tells us to make a directory named temp work. If you're more advanced, you can jump in and just bang this stuff out, follow along and just do it. But maybe you're new to Linux or new to the command line, you might need help. I'm going to click this little icon over here that looks like a copy. It tells me it's copied to the clipboard. Now I can jump right over and paste that. And it keeps me from having to type the command. Now, the reason I point that out is one of the struggles for people that are new to Linux is typing the commands out. Sometimes you may not have time for that. Maybe your, your objective here, your learning objective, is specifically to learn how this specific Sandworm APT works. You don't, you can learn Linux later. That's not your focus right now. Well, that's why you can do the copy and paste. And that's why we have a totally immersive learning environment. The, we're obsessed with learning, not so much as being a proving ground, which is what most of the other cyber ranges out there are. Now, if you notice when I completed this third step, it gave me the little green arrow up here to let me know that like, look, you've completed this task. And as you move on to the next step, and this is where I want to show you how it gets really interesting. So we're going to create a control file here and look at, even with all this stuff, again, you can manually type these things out or in the nano file that we've created, I can just paste it. And it warns me like, hey, you're getting ready to paste something that could be unsafe. Are you sure? And I say yes. And then it goes and tells me now close out of nano and save this file. Well, if I'm a beginner, I may not know how to do that. Right. So if you don't know how to do that, you can go to need a hint here, for example, and we give you these hints to tell you how to do the things that we're asking you to do. But if you're advanced, you don't need that hint. Right. You can just, you know, to like do control X, you know, to save the, to say, I want to save the changes and hit Y for yes and hit enter and save it. And one of the things that our team put a lot of effort into doing with this new cyber range is making it very friendly and very useful to the very advanced learner and the beginner learner. Let's say you do struggle with these commands and you realize, you know what, I really need a lot more Linux training before I tackle advanced adversary tactics. So you can go jump right out into the learning platform, go back to the, the pass and just take the video recorded training. If I wanted to go and get some more Linux hands-on, I could very easily go to the cyber range, back to the cyber range, and then look for the Linux cyber range, which is we see here, and we could just go into the Linux cyber range and just do basic Linux without having to do tasks such as uh, trying to create an APT like we were doing uh, in that advanced APT Sandworm lab. Uh, I'm looking forward to you jumping in here, uh, jumping into some of my courses, jumping into some of the other courses, and I'm anxious to hear your feedback on the things that you like to see added.